like to welcome you all to Sunday morning at her bed. Excuse me while I adjust my camera. This uh, production, of course, has to meet only the highest of standards. As I was saying, it is uh, it's about 8 a.m., 8.06 a.m. on this Sunday morning, October 4th. Quite nice outside, 58 degrees, sunny skies, green grass. Today's going to be a beautiful day, so it warms up to 83 degrees. It, uh, it was this with this May last night when I heard on the news that our uh, former fire chief of our local volunteer fire department, Red Barton, had passed away. Red, uh, Red was quite an icon on the lake here for years and years. He was the one of the founders and fire chief of our volunteer fire department and ambulance service, which is one of the best in the state, as well as uh, the lake patrol officer for many years. Red was known by all for his, well, for his fairness and, and his dedication. He will surely be missed. <sighs> to uh, send my condolences to Mike and uh, the rest of the Barton family. As we uh, go up the road, eight and a half miles to Haslett, 58 degrees and sunny there too. What do you know? Go down to San Antonio, yes, home of the uh, Alamo. 59 and cloudy there. Gonna warm up to 89, so it'll be a nice day. Brett, uh, the soccer coach, is uh, done quite a, quite a good job with the kids. They all have uh, a good time. Yesterday, as they got out on the soccer field, had a soccer match. All right, don't hit each other. <laughs> on three, we're gonna say have fun, ready? <laughs> One, two, three, have fun! Hey, what's for my <laughs> Keep up the good work, Brent. Down to, uh, or I should say, over to the front range, Colorado to Scott and the gang. Chilly there, 49 degrees and cloudy as it warms to, uh, holy cow, it's only going to be 67 for right. the day in Colorado. Winter is coming. <laughs> so we go on, we'll go out to Ontario, say hello to Betsy the Uber gal. 76 cloudy, going to be 69 there. A uh, nice warm day across the sea to London. Hello, Captain Jack Carlin's at a Zelda. Sixty-three, <laughs> cloudy. Uh, Mulu Lava down under. Friend Joe posted this picture of a Catholic church yesterday in Melbourne as he thanked everyone for their prayers and help. <laughs> Recover from that terrible cancer he's fighting. 67 in Clare and Mulu Lava. And then we go to Melbourne, where it's presently 59, but it's warming up to 89 degrees, which is great for our friend Steve because today is Steve's birthday. Happy birthday to you, Steve. We know how much you hate winter time. So your birthday gift, nice warm spring days. I'm sure you'll be throwing some shrimps on the barbie and beers in the cooler. Have a good one. Well, as we continue on, let's see. We go to Tyler, Texas. My friend Carol Denton. Gonna be nice there today, too. She posted this photo of five siblings. <laughs> Well, her four siblings just got their new sister, Samine, who came home from the hospital the other day. And uh, no, I, th I think that's pretty cool. You know, I'm trying to recover, so every day I do a little more trying to build myself up. So today, I took a walk down, down there. And it was quite nice. As I walked along, I, I did go by Robert's house where the demolish you get slower than you And then on to the park as I walked through the park under the trees and ice cream. 
Then out on the dock to the serene waters of Eagle Mountain Lake. And there are even some ducks going by in the way south. Really nice out there. I think you might see a few guys fishing. And nice waters of the pristine lake as the sun comes up over the marina. What a great way to start the day. Well, let's see as I continue on. I don't want to forget anybody. Uh, oh, got to go to Poggle Poggle. See our friend Steve Migas, where he reported on the annual regatta in Pago Pago, and as you can see, waters are just absolutely beautiful. I asked Steve why he didn't enter his good ship, the Adventurer, in the yachting race, and he explained that he didn't think the 20 tons would do very well. But I did did mention to him that I think he'd be pretty popular if he parked her at the finish line. He could give everybody a nice watermelon as they sail across the finish line of the race. It's 78 light rain in Pago Pago today, but overall a nice spring day. So that's uh, that's a roundup today. Did want to say hello to everyone. I do hope you all have a good weekend on this Sunday. So. Have a good day. Good morning to you.